Hello everyone, welcome back. Today I would like to show you how to dual boot Mac and Windows on the normal PC. In this video, we assume that you already installed Windows on your computer and then all you need to do just install a Mac and then you can run Windows and Mac. And for me, I recommend you using the external hard drive. If you have any error, it doesn't affect your computer, especially the data on your computer. And all you have to do after you install Mac OS X on the external hard drive. So if you want to use the Mac, just plug in the external to your computer and you can use the Mac and if you don't want to use the Mac just unplug the external and then you can power on your computer and use the window normally so now let's get straight into the video so before we can get start and then you need to download nirehmohave.dmg so the file size is 6GB and the download link can be found in description and then you need to install Transmac. It is a software that allows you to create bootable USB. So after that you can open it. So run as administrator and then you will see your USB stick here. So right click and then click on restore with this image and then hit on yes. And now you need to select the this image. So my this image is on the desktop near Mojave here. And then finally you can click on OK. But for me I have already created the bootable USB so I don't have to do that. So now after you create bootable USB, restart your computer. So after you restart, make sure you connect the bootable USB and the external hard drive at the same time. So we're gonna install the Mac OS Mojave from the USB into the external hard drive. So make sure both are connected to the computer. So when you restart and the screen goes black, make sure you hit on the key to go to BIO. My computer is there, so when I want to go to BIO, I just hit on F12. And if you have any other different computer, it may have different key, so you need to figure it out. And now we go to BIOS, and then you can use arrow down to go to the UEFI partition here, which is my USB, and then hit on enter. And now we go into the setup screen here. So you can you can use arrow left and right to navigate. Make sure you select boot Mac OS install from Nirah Mojave. This is the file from the USB that we have just created. So hit on enter. And in case your trackpad doesn't work, you can connect your USB mouse into your computer. And then you can click on next. Now we are on the setup screen here, so click on continue and then click on continue again, click on agree. So before we install Mac Mojave on external hard drive, we need to go to this utility to erase it first. So go to utility and then click on this utility. And now you can see the page here, so select on the, make sure you see the external and then click on new volume here which is my external hard drive so I can simply click on erase and format should be Mac OS journal and then give it a name so I'm gonna go to Mojave and then click on erase and now click on done and then you can go back and go back to utility again so this time you're gonna go to terminal and to avoid the error make sure you change the date on the so I'm gonna type date space and then hit on return key and now it should be like this and then you can close the terminal and then you can select the drive that you have just erased and then on customize you need to install some cake so all of this cake are selected by default so I'm gonna leave it at default and then click on accept and finally click on continue And then after restart, make sure you press the key to go to BIOS again. Now this time you need to select your external hard drive. So because we have already installed it on the external hard drive, 
So now you need to boot from external hard drive. So hit on enter. And then you will see a lot of drive again. So but this time you need to make sure boot Mac away from Mojave. And then hit on enter key. And finally, guys, we are on the setup screen. So now choose your country. So I'm gonna go to Cambodia and then click on continue. Continue again. And my computer does not connect to the internet, so we can connect it later on. And then click on continue. Continue again. And continue. So don't transfer any information now. Continue. And now click on agree, click on agree again, and name your Mac, so I'm gonna go to Mojave, password, and then click on continue, continue again, and you can select between dark and light mode. And finally, guys, we are on the desktop of Mac Mojave and we are running on the external hard drive. And as you can see, my external hard drive are running Mac OS Mojave and running on my computer right here. So now if you want to go back to Windows and now you need to restart your hack install. And then you can unplug the external hard drive. And when you restart, you don't need to click any F key to go to BIO. It will automatically boot to Windows when you unplug the external. So, and as you can see, we have the window loading screen here. So you don't need to worry about click on any key. It will boot automatically into the window. And as you can see, and now we are boot back to Windows. And this is very easy method to install the Mac OS to go. And then when you want to use the Mac OS on any computer, you can just connect, plug in the external hard drive that we have just installed into the other computer. So, and then it will run straight away. 
and you don't have to reinstall it and finally thanks for watching and i hope you like this video and if you have any question related to this you can comment down below and i will try to answer as much as possible